um, I'm going to show you how to set up a Wi-Fi ad hoc connection with uh, Windows XP and um, your iPod or iPhone. So on the Windows XP we go to start, control panel, network connections and uh, then we find our local area connection which is the connection where the uh, internet cable is connected or through which it, the internet cable is connected we click on properties, right click properties then go to advanced and then we check allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection and then we select from the drop down well, we should be able to select the wireless network, but we have it disabled, so we just go cancel out of here and um, right click on wireless network connection, enable it first. So now it's enabled, not connected because it's not connected to anything at the moment. So then we go back to the local area connection advanced allow other computers to connect and now we have it there wireless network connection and then click OK and we wait now it's done so the next step is to go to wireless network connection properties right click on it and click properties then go to advanced actually to wireless networks make sure that you have this tick because sometimes some computers have um, different um, software that manages wireless networks and maybe it's good if it's clicked this is clicked for this time and we add a network we name it, you can name it for example my ad hoc we choose network authentication well it's good to choose some kind of encryption always otherwise somebody else, anybody, your neighbor or somebody can connect through your connection so we choose the VPA Just the shared one and we VEP. Uh, the key is not provided, so we untick that and we choose the key. So we type password. And then make sure that this at the bottom computer to computer ad hoc network is ticked well, this is what I was thinking when I was entering the password how long how many characters should, should the password be and um, it actually tells you either 5 or, or 13 depending which which kind of connection we selected so this is the uh, minimum encryption so it will be 5 characters change that to something that has five characters and then click OK then we can click OK one more time and now we can go to wireless networks right click view uh, these are the networks that my computer sees around and we should be able to see my, my ad hoc here which is at the bottom right here and click on that connect then we enter the same key as we did just a while ago connect 
and this is my kind of hang and you know not do anything but we can already go to our iPhone or iPod and I try it this way I'm not sure if anybody's going to be able to see it I hope so so let's go to settings on your iPhone or iPod touch Wi-Fi and there you should be able to see network connection so there it is my ad hoc we select that we enter password and click join it says it's done also the other, other thing the whatever it was on the computer got satisfied and now we should be able to browse so let's go let's open a new window new page and let's go to Yahoo well there is another thing for some of you if this happens that you can can cannot connect to the internet make sure that all your firewall that you have installed like for example I have the zone arm free firewall it, it can be creating some kind of issues you should be able to set it up in a way it allows the connection but for now I just switch it off um, and reload and now it seems that it's, it's working yeah so now I'm getting internet Yahoo and everything right there horoscopes oops horoscopes there it is so that firewall might be actually quite annoying if you have something like zone alarm or it could be even the default windows firewall creating some issues but um, then you would have to go to the um, control panel and I think it's in the security center and actually there is windows firewall you would need to try to switch it off it should work even with switch on but then you would have to set play around and find some kind of exceptions settings so I'll leave you with that